Hello everyone, this is Just a Dad. Today I'm going to show you how to shut down an iPhone. So if you're having problems with your iPhone, it's a good idea to power it all the way down. So I used to think that this button was a power button, but it's not the power button when, you're, when your phone comes from out of the box. Again, when you just hit this button once, that's called like a sleep mode. It doesn't really shut it down. Again, this fixes so many problems when you power the system completely down and power it back up. Okay, so unlock your phone. You gotta go to settings. So find the settings, scroll down a little bit. You gotta go to general. So I went to general. Make sure you go right there to general. Then you're gonna scroll all the way down. At the very bottom is the word shutdown. So you're gonna select that. Now we gotta slide this across, okay? This is gonna power it all the way down. Slide that across, your screen goes black. Now wait about five minutes. Let it kind of power down, just completely get um, all the way down, and then we're gonna power it back up. Okay, so it's been a little bit. Now this is a power button for, for powering it on. On the right-hand side, right there, we're gonna hold that in. We gotta hold it in. Sometimes it takes a little longer than you think. Hold it in, you get the Apple logo. Once you get the Apple logo, let up, and the system's gonna boot up. Now, it is gonna require a password, a passcode. The face ID will not work when you power something down and power it back up. Okay, so here we are, swipe up, swipe up, and again, you gotta enter your passcode now. And now you're back. So this can fix, sometimes your phone becomes disconnected from the cell towers, it can fix all kinds of things. It's just a good idea to power down your phone completely at least once every week, maybe two weeks, at least once every three or four weeks. So I hope this video helps. Thanks everybody for watching.